In a typical day, I drive into work. I work at a NASA facility, the Jet Propulsion Laboratory, and we have a lot of wildlife, a lot of flowers. We're in the mountains there in Pasadena, California. We see deer. Sometimes there's been a bear on lab. That was a little scary. And then we go in and we first look at the data from Curiosity that it had acquired on the day before, on the Mars day, which is called a Sol, on the Sol before. Curiosity's typical day is that in her morning, she receives commands and instructions from Earth. Then she executes those. So she does all of the activities that we plan for her. She acquires a whole bunch of science data, images, things like that. Then that data gets sent back to Earth and then we, the engineers, as well as the scientists, look at that data and decide what Curiosity is going to do the next day. So the scientists are looking at from a point of view of what, where do they want to drive or what rocks do they want to explore in more detail. And the engineers were looking at to see if Curiosity is healthy and if all of the activities executed properly. And then we're also contributing constraints to the science team. We're telling them how much power they have and those types of things and whether or not it's safe to, to do that. And then as a rover planner, uh, I either plan specifically the commands for the arm, how to place the robotic arm on things or how to sieve those samples and drop them off, or also plan the driving. And that's really fun because we get to put on our 3D glasses and look at the rocks, look at all the terrain and say, oh, is this rock safe to drive over? Do I wanna, when I stop and I'm about to place the drill on a rock, do I really wanna be perched up like one wheel on a big rock? I probably don't. So those are the types of things we're looking at, putting on those 3D glasses and feeling like we're on Mars almost.